Wait, darn it, it fell into one of the things. Okay, we do, we do. Hey guys, we're going to do a quick video on how to use these Cascade dishwashing packs for the first time. If you saw the other video of how to use a Tide Pod for the first time, there's a link below or at the end of the video. Um, so anyways, it's very simple. Basically, we buy a bunch of these pods, we fill up the whole um, dishwashing machine, and we just put it on the bottom of the dishwashing machine, and we close it up, and that's really about it. And then we set the thing to wash or normal and just let it go. So a normal wash, just put the tight the cascade pod in there or pack in there and just let it go. You might want to pick up some other options, but we usually don't. We just let the normal thing happen and there we go. That's all you have to do. It's as simple as that. What we bought was this cascade platinum. It has 62 in it. I'll leave a few links below if you're interested. Um, but this is extremely simple. We switched from using powder and stuff to this because this is a lot simpler. The platinum one has the most cleaning power and everything else, so that's why we liked it. And normally you're supposed to put it in these um, in these two this cubby hole in there. So you're supposed to put it in that little cubby hole, lock it up, and then uh, let the thing go. But we realized after using it a few times that it's a lot more efficient just basically um, putting it on the bottom of the washing machine after we packed a full pack. The main thing of doing this is getting making sure your hand is dry while you reach in and grab one, because if your hand is wet, it melts those things and it basically gets all over your hand. Not a good thing. So, long story short, it comes with a whole bucket full of this stuff. You could probably get this at Costco or online or whatever. I'll leave a few links below, like I said. Uh, but at the same time, here is you know the back of this package. If you want to see that, basically just dump in the thing and be done with it. Just five easy steps. Just close it, the tub after thing. You don't want to make sure, you want to make sure the tub is dry. So you want to keep the tub closed. We load up all our utensils in the front stack up all the, our smaller um, cups and Tupperware on the top rack of the, uh, of the washing machine. No, not washing machine, dishwasher machine. And then we also put, of course, like the plates and stuff, the larger plates on the bottom. You just get one of these packs, just put it on the bottom of the dishwashing machine, and that's all you really need to do and set to normal and you're done. It's extremely simple. We usually don't want to waste the pack, so what we do is we basically fill up the entire machine before um, before we start washing, that could take like one or two days, but it's fine. Uh, but we set it on a super hot wash so that it cleans up everything. Um, we don't use the air dry either. So anyways, that's really about it in case of how to do it. Um, if you're wondering about the other stuff on the washing, um, the dishwashing machine, there's other things that you're supposed to put. There's some sort of weird uh, rinse liquid stuff you're supposed to put. We don't use that anymore. Um, we used to buy powder and put it in. You're supposed to put powder in both of those uh, compartments, one in the first one that's open and the other one in this canopy that closes and locks down. You put in those same levels there. Now, you know, whether you put, you know, most of the time it's powder and that's what it was before. It's kind of, with that little pack, it actually has all of them together. That door actually flips open after like the mid wash or something like that. So it goes for a second cycle or whatever it is. But to be honest, I, you know, after using it a few times, like this is a lot more simple. It's getting a little packet like this and just throwing it into the bottom. We did notice that, you know, after that detergent in these washing machines wear away the labels of our cups and stuff. And something to note, um, this basically the Cascade one doesn't even do it as bad as the other ones we used. We, before we used really, really strong detergent and it just basically ground away, you know, the lettering off the thing. So probably not the best thing. Afterwards, after everything's washed, just go ahead and stack all the plates and that's really about it. So quickie video on how to use one of these um, uh, pod things are so simple. You just basically put it in, change to normal. Just make sure your dishwasher is all loaded up and locked in and snug and then just go ahead and go. Anyways, please like, subscribe, hit the bell button for more, more Costco finds, other DIYs and other, you know, other fun videos on how to do things. And that's really about it, guys. Thanks for supporting this channel and watching. And leave some comments below, as well as other fun tips and tricks below as well. See you next time.